handle these ones by the knife here. Yes, that is the first. Namaste and greeting from Susiman Santos. Today I'm gonna show you how to fill a sieving. Okay, that is the part one video, and in the part two I'm gonna teach you how to use filleted sieving for the sushi. Okay, let's go. Here I have the sieving. That is very fresh sieving. Okay, sushi lords family. First of all, you need to know how to choose freshness of the fish. Okay, firstly you need to see the eye. If the eye is clean, clean eye, and there is the shiny eye, it's fish is fresh. And another things you have to see the gills. The gills should be a pink, red, and bloody. And another thing is the yeah, scales. If the scales is coming out, it's the fish is not fresh. And another thing is the wings. If the wings are very good, as you can see here also, if the wings is fresh, the fish is fresh. Okay, let's go. First of all, I'm gonna cut the head. Before the head, I want to open the belly. Let's go. As you can see here, here is the small hole. So it will be easy to put here the knife. I'm gonna teach you how to take the belly part, okay? When you are cutting, you have to cut from here to all around here, okay? Yes, there is the belly, I'm gonna take out. Okay, now let's cut the head. When you are cutting the head, you have to be careful with the wings. Yes, that's right. Again, another side, similar like that one. Yes. Now I'm gonna cut panel these ones by the knife. Yes. That is the garbage. This head we can use for the making the soup, dashi, or stock or broth we can make. Okay, I'm gonna put here. Here is the black part as you can see here. Firstly, I'll cut this ones. There is the blood, so we have to clean this ones. I'll take out, okay. Okay, as you can see here, I took the scales first, then after I took the belly, then after I cut the head, and also I clean here the bloody part, I already clean, okay? When you are flirting these ones, you have to be careful with these wings, okay? <clears throat> we have to fillet the fish outside the wings and the downside of the wings. So, I'm gonna put the knife here, like here. Then after I will fit like this, okay? Firstly, I'm gonna cut this side. Let's go. Here is also wings. We have to be careful with these wings, okay? Here. Yes. Yes, there is the bone. Now that side. Now I'll put the knife here and take this. 
Okay, let's go. From here, I'm gonna put the knife here. Yes. That is the first flat. As you can see here, it's a beautiful flat. The second fillet, that is the first fillet. To take the second fillet, I'm gonna put here. I already cut a little bit here. Okay. I'm, I'm gonna cut from this side. If you want, you can put like this and you can cut from here also. Look like. I'm gonna, this, that is the very simple and easy way. Yes. Now I'll put knife here. Yes. That is the second fillet. This is how we can fillet the sea brim very easily this is for the beginner here is the first fillet there is the second fillet and that is the bones that bones and the that head part as you can see here that we can use for the stock we can make the very good and tasty and delicious soup okay don't worry about it here is the little bit more meat don't worry about it because we, we can make the basi that fillet we can use for the if you want you can make the sushi if you don't want you can make the grill it's depend on you okay first of all I'm gonna take the that that belly part, belly bones, okay? I'm gonna clean here, I'm gonna cut here, then softly and gently, okay? Put always your finger like this so you can secure the meat so uh, meat cannot be totally blocked, okay? Yes, finally, slowly and softly, try to cut less meat from this part, okay? Don't cut like this totally meat. That is very good, nice. There is a little bit white part. I'm gonna clean this once softly and gently. Yes, that part is ready. Now I'm gonna clean another part, same as like that one. That is the belly bones. That is the very fatty part, that is the belly part. So we have to be careful when you are cutting the that kinds of bones. Don't cut too much meat because that's the really tasty meat. I really like the nigiri from that side. Okay, here is the scales a little bit. I'm gonna take out here. I'm gonna teach you two different way. Okay, first is the very good and very easy. That fillet I'm gonna cut from here in the middle part. Look. Yes. That is the upper side part and here is the bones, middle bones, so we can cut directly middle bones. Yes, that is will go garbage and we don't have the middle bones. We clean it very well, very easily. The second things I'm going to teach you, if you have the small fish, you cannot make the negative with this piece, so we have to take the all the middle bones, okay, let's go. Look, here is the, yes, when you are taking the middle spines, middle bones, you have to secure the meat like this, so meat cannot come and it cannot broke, the, the, the broken chance will be a little low, okay, here is the, also, another one, yes, Yes, here is also, and we have to use our finger to find out where is the middle bones. Yeah, here is another one, another one, and here is the another one. I hope that is all. That's all. We don't have more. Yes. Now I'm gonna teach you how to take out the skins. Okay. One is we can use here the hot water 
we will put here the salt and we can use the hot water and we can use directly with these skins because the skin will be a uh, soft and uh, we have the very good taste between the meat and skin so we don't need to take out the skins because we already take out the skins and another way is the we can take the skins very easily let's see put here cut a little bit here and make the securing part okay here so it will be easy to secure then softly pass your knife in between the skins and the meat for this don't worry about it if it happens try from this side okay i'll cut here because my knife is very sharp that's why yeah very good nice and now i'm gonna take out these ones these ones i'm gonna uh, use with the hot water and the salt okay let's see then i will make the beautiful sushi don't go away from this video okay stay tuned i'm gonna make the sushi from this fillet sushi and sashimi that's all i'm gonna take out the skins from here same as like that one I'll cut here a little bit and take the skin softly and gently. Wow, it's very good. Look. Nice. 